Hi, welcome back to Tanya's Beauty Box. I'm doing it a little bit differently today. I'm just I'm going to do a basic show and tell. I'm not going to be on camera in person, but I wanted to go ahead and get my Boxy Charm base box September 2020 um, uh, recorded and posted. So this is um, September 2020 Boxy Charm, the base box, the regular box. Still waiting on the Lux. Um, which is odd, but I'm hoping it will come soon. So let's open it up and see what's going on. So this is what's in the base box. I did kind of look at it, and because I guess I wasn't all that um, enamored with it, uh, I just was kind of like laxing on recording it. But um, this is the motivation that I have for this box at the moment. So this is the Glam Vibes Only box, and this is variation number... 44 so i'm just going to go ahead and dig right in and get into this box and let's see what's going on the very first thing i have to show you guys is the pharmacy cheer up brightening vitamin c eye cream with our acerola cherry and the um, retail price is 45 dollars. that would be this particular product here pharmacy is a very um i don't want to say it's very expensive but it is uh, mid to upper level upper a per level tier um, skincare company. Um, they seem to infuse a lot of um, fruit based um, items, kind of like little recipe uh, fruit based items in their uh, product. And this is the uh, Pharmacy Cheer Up, which I guess has um, some type of cherry infusion in it. Um, eye cream. And I'm going to assume, since they put that in there, that that chick R was it acerola cherry is something that will definitely work well for your eyes so that's the very first thing the next thing that's on the sheet is the alamar cosmetics spanglish pressed pigment palette so that's what this looks like oh it's sealed can i get in this seal without uh i guess i should have thought about that before i um attempted to do this video um man no it doesn't want to let me in okay let me work on mm. yeah i can't get in this okay here i go so i'm gonna spend a lot of time <laughs> i'm working with one hand trying to get this seal off of here I'm so sorry, guys. I forgot the seal was on here, which is a good thing, which means nobody's been in the product. But when you're doing a one-handed video, it doesn't um, bode well. Okay, so this is a lot of pinks and purples. Um, purple tones and like a um, reddish, orange toned um, brown and a shimmery, goldy tone. Well, they got some pink infused in that. So that's pretty. And this is called the Spanglish Palette. And this palette is worth $28. So sorry about that. The next thing we have is from Hank and Henry. And I like the packaging. And this is the Lust Lipstick. Now this is the Hank and Henry Lip Love Luxe Lipstick. And this is $18. And um... Let's see what this is about. So I didn't um, open this up. I just kind of, oh, I really like this. That's cute. And again, like I said, this is called uh, Lust. Don't want to focus here. But um, I was able to tell that this is called Lust from the name there. So let's, how do we get in here? There's a button here. Let's see. Okay, so you press it down. Oh, and it comes out like that. So there's the bullet. And let's see what color this is. Hope it's not red. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, it's sparkly. Now, that is beautiful. It's not really doing it justice on um, my little phone camera here. So some kind of like brown situation with lots of sparkle overlay. I like that. I'm not going to... Um, even though I like it, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep that. The packaging is just wonderful. I really like the packaging. And you just push the bullet back down in here and um, it uh, seals back up. So I like that. So it's a push button situation. Packaging is beautiful. Um, 
yeah, it kind of reminds me of, I think I have the Estee Lauder um, lipstick that uh, this package like that, the mechanism. Next we have from Billion Dollar Brows. I'm sorry, Billion Dollar Beauty, the Billion Dollar Beauty Sponge with is vegan and charcoal infused. So there's not that much to say about this in particular. It's a beauty um, beauty blender-esque style sponge. Let's see what's going on here. So there we go. And it has BSB with a dollar sign um, on it. And apparently it's charcoal infused. Let's see. Uh, the charcoal infused beauty sponge provides the perfect application for any liquid foundation, concealer, or highlighter. Let's see. I wonder why they are uh, have it charcoal infused. They have information here, but it doesn't say what is the purpose of having it charcoal infused. And that's 15 bucks. And the very last thing I have is from Laura Geller. Now, we're seeming to get a lot of Laura Geller stuff in these boxes lately from um, BoxyCharm. And this is the Lash Boss Bold. And look at that brush. That's a nice side, nice style brush. I like fiber brushes. I'm not really into the, um, what you might call the rubber bristle brushes. Um, I like the fiber brushes. They seem to do well on my lashes. And it's traditional packaging. So I'm not going to open it because the, the brush head was um, depicted on the actual packaging itself. So it's basic black packaging. Um, this is like the before and after, which is not all that impressive to me. But, I mean, it's good if you want like a simple um, everyday look lash, I would think. And there's the, uh, the brush again. It says wavy, wavy fibers protective properties smooth formula so there you go and that is $24 so I got the mascara I got that wonderful lipstick I really like the lipstick and the packaging and um, how they styled the lipstick with all those sparkles but I'm not sure if I can deal with that color but it's beautiful it's a beautiful um, crafted lipstick I just uh, don't know if I'll um, like the color on me I got the pharmacy cheer up eye cream I got a billion dollar brushes um, beauty blender and last but not least from Spanglish uh, I'm sorry from Alamar the Spanglish press pigment palette I'll open that up again just to show you um, whoops sorry oh the, the uh, that's some very sticky tape and there are the colors again. So the colors are very nice. You know, I'm almost at the point where I used to really love getting palettes. But now all these palettes are driving me nuts because i got so many of them. I can never really get to them or anything. And I end up just giving them away. So that's more than likely going to end up in a giveaway. This um, billion dollar brushes. Um, uh beauty blender situation this may end up in a giveaway I mean it's beautiful I mean it's no point to keep it just because it's beautiful but I won't probably wear it and um yeah I don't know maybe even this eye cream so I mean out of all these things I would keep this just because of the packaging how the, the actual bullet looks and this mascara but I might end up giving away this whole box I don't know I gotta start to rethink my boxycharm subscriptions and if they are of value to me but thank you so much for um watching this video I know it's a little bit different um, I apologize for not having the palette open but um, yeah I just want to go ahead and get this out like I said I wasn't too thrilled with it so I didn't have that much motivation but I did want to show it to you and get it posted so thank you so much for watching this video continue to support the channel if you wish um, like comment and subscribe and I will see you on the next video stay um, whimsical and let your inner whimsy shine